Hello there everyone and welcome back to Old World Blues A to Z series in which we're playing as of course Han Warbam led by Warlord Han. Now we've already done one or two more focuses off screen than where we left off but we're recruiting new minds. A fresh pair of eyes can go a long way. To avoid stagnation of thought and a decline in innovation, we'll do well to search for alternate perspectives in the wasteland. I guess we can get Daisy Roth now. Further industrialized knowledge or further industrial knowledge. The old world has many secrets to teach us on how to best optimize our industrial organization. Let's learn what we can, but make sure to remember our own discoveries. I continue the I-20 restoration work. One of the few weaknesses of the I-20 trade is the state of disrepair of some sections. It's by no means poor quality construction, but touch-ups could certainly help. Uh, so we need overcharged ammo, basic if it's treatment. Dark. Cool. Basic infantry treatment. Overcharged ammo. You know what? We're gonna go ahead and get that one done now. We got no research last for it. We can't go to war with the Texan Brotherhood yet. But uh Pecos Colony is destroying Landis' Legion. As you can see, Kaiser's Legion has exploded, and they're fighting the Rio Pact at the same time, which is not very good for them. So it looks like we're gonna have a gigantic Rio Pact that we could, we're gonna to have to contend with. Oh no longer increasing our power, eh? Um well, we do want a core more. We took out the hand warband last time. We, took, we did a lot of things actually last time. Do we have enough infantry equipment? No, we don't. But we do have a cup of coffee. It keeps nice and warm. And, uh, yeah. Oh, we gotta do this stuff as well. That'll be good. Set up actions. Set up people down. We can actually build maybe some labs. I think that'd be great. Optimized trading we could, but we don't really need to do that. With this drill's immediate draft, probably not. Oh, my god. Wow. That kind of sucks. But that's not our problem. Uh, Daisy Ruth? Alexander Morgan. Uh, Patrick. Holmgren. Oh, recruit new mines. Uh, you know what? That's pretty good. Trader. It's not bad. Development's at home. Uh, okay, that's a little right. Let's go with this guy. Mercenary front lines. We will need more population too. Let's go for three. And then what? We start the turbines. Well, let's go with uh, cutting edge developments. A proud economy will grow ever stronger off the backs of scientific advancements. Very true. We're not going to go to war soon. Simulation not worth doing. We're still getting... Yeah. Cool. Let's see. Do we want more scrap and build technology and water? Or do we want more energy, circuitry and building technology? But we actually could use more scrap. Look at that. You know what? Let's go with the, the scrap then. Scrap the turbines. The Great War was the final blow and what was a foolhardy project to begin with. Let's scrap these turbines and turn their parts into valuable resources. Sounds good to me. Because it looks like we definitely need them. We have a lot to conquer this episode, don't we? Hey! Hey, more money. That's always good. Expand army trading? Absolutely. You're not allowed to stop, basically. But we demanded, uh, basically, the former Fort Summers territories from the Legion. But they didn't want to give it to us. So, go figure. Um, you know, we can do that too, why not? How much money do we have right now? 166, that's not bad, 117 every month. Like I said, I do want to core these series too. It's gonna take a little bit of time to get there, but it's only 53. Save up a little bit more for that. There's just a different Mexicano. Oh, okay. Interesting. Ah, oh, cutting edge developments are nice. Focus on low-tech extraction. We obviously need resources, but why complicate the matter? A crude yet efficient, a system will no doubt serve us best. And Lone Star pro prospers. Look at that. Our Earths haven't been for naught. Lone Star shines brighter every day, and its radiance will soon consume the waste. From coast to coast, everyone will soon sing the praise of the Lone Star Traders. Or really, hand warband traders. Yeah, it makes more sense. Um, we do 
Freedom with our part of the Legion? Yes. Is there anything else we throw on top of here? No. Oh, yes. I know you're wrong. Um, they hurt their recruitable population factor by quite a bit. But Special Forces gets even stronger, which is nice. How strong are these guys down here? They're looking relatively thick, which is not good for us. Yeah, focus on low tech extraction. That'll be fine. Roads are nice, but how do we do that? Because all these guys have got to be built up too. Build, 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 build. All right, scrap the turbines. That's actually pretty nice for us. Prospectors, anything else we really care here? Not yet, in a little bit, probably. Um, science. Science points, income, nothing. transfer a couple of labs over. Looks like we actually could really use them. Peace of war, optimized training, country management, more stability? Sure, why not? Culture simulation, media draft, and eh, local energy recruitment, that's alright. So we have 25 divisions. How many divisions does the Brotherhood actually have? They don't have a lot of manpower. Oh my god, they have a lot of divisions. Um, yeah, they have a lot of divisions. Oof. Can we even take him on? This game just found something. Hey, we've got Robco. Don't need Robco, but sure, why not? So we're done with all of that technology. We can come do that one, I guess. And then uh, Lone Star Prospers. And soon enough, well, basic infantry equipment as well. Okay, we need more divisions in this. Let's get six. Extraction. I've come to civilized tech. Get more manpower there. Uh, let's help core creation costs eventually, too, which would be nice. 1.47. There you go. Point two a day, basically. And after this, weapons for the warlord. We must push weapon capabilities beyond the conventional limits to ensure that we keep the edge in combat. Should be good. All right. Don't just core that one. That's fine. God, what's going on? Oh, is the Legion capitulating? I hope the game doesn't crash. Oh, Lance is... Did they peace out? They might have peaced out or something. Or, Lanius's Legion is now gray? Oh, the ally... Oh, Iron Alliance is leading the Legion. This part of the Legion. And they have sense of Kaisar. They're still fighting everybody. Interesting. And then they have Legion of Hades by themselves. It was actually allied with the reservation, but it doesn't matter. Wow, what a freaking mess. And Warband, we already went asymmetric warfare. Good. Um, robots wouldn't make any sense refined. Old world conventional tactics. It's definitely not mean, it's either elite or old world. Uh, any army is only strong as its soldiers, and we must strive to make our troops the absolute best they can be. Old World Tactics. Old World saw armies larger than we can imagine, fighting across the entire world, with blinding speed and advancing tactics. We should emulate these old battle styles and battle plans to the best of our abilities. Because if we go with the refined, <clears throat> all that does is help out the heavy special forces in the end. And it gives you more empathy here, too. Yeah, heavy special forces, though. Army. 
Purity doesn't make any sense for us. I guess we'll go with Old World. For now. For this campaign. Yeah. Scrap Jacks. Stuff. Couple days left. Just flip a bower. It's a lot of town, but that's all right. Oh, there's a manpower. Well, we need to get more divisions. We we'll need to raise the conscription level. Oh, look at that, nice. Yeah, but to do that, I'm going to make it first. Slightly more population, not very much more, but slightly more. Academic advisors, eh, Captain Co. Yeah. Rob Co. Probably not going to use Rob Co. for this one. Yeah, I definitely want regular front lines. I heard war support. Actually, this is reward support by 6%. 8% to 10%. We actually lost 2% attack and defense. So, get a level more stability with mercenary front lines. Complete mercenary forces. It makes sense just to go here, why not? Why wouldn't we want to do this? Actually, why would you not go Old World Conscription? Long before the Great War, Conscription was introduced to ensure there was always men available to defend the nation. We should follow this lead, introducing a general draft of loyal men. Why would we not choose this one? That this is 2% more attack and defense. I guess you are technically a leading officer, but whatever. Two now? Holy cow. Why do we need so many guns? I guess we're making a lot more divisions, but still. Well, that's the case. Like more military factories, I guess. Adopt modern military structures? The pre war American states had a powerful military fuel by conscription. We should follow suit if we want to stay competitive in combat. Bring our army closer to the model to uh, pre Great War America. Two new levels of conscription levels be unlocked. And get more daily army XP. That's good. I like that. Let's make sure all these divisions are good to go. Um, looking pretty good. Enclosure's nice too. Better core creation cost because we'll need that eventually. Um, infantry wise, 20 combo width, oh, almost 20 combo width. Looking pretty good. NCR on the jackals, tight nuts. I'd hate, I'd hate to have tight nuts myself, but you know, whatever. You're only level 4, you know what, you can be inspiration for this one. Boom. Uh, so, so now we get 15 science points, okay. You know what, let's increase science points, we got money for it. It's fine. Armor training? Yeah. You're trying to maximize everything as much as possible. Seeing that ain't big enough. Although Texas is enormous indeed, so are the arrogance of the Texas Brotherhood. Let's take them down and show who rules Texas once and for all.
Gives us more entrenchment because they have a lot of divisions here. If we could just hold the line against them, that'd be great. I want to do encirclement around them. But we'll see because they have so many divisions, it's not funny. We don't have enough manpower for them. Do we unlock any more conscription laws? Regular exclusive armies. I mean, you might as well go down this route. We lose 4% stability to give them more war support. No more air defense, maybe. So here's complete mercenary forces, which actually is not great. Warp entity, stability modifier is not bad, and we get more stability. But overall conscription, you hurt our stability, we get more attack and defense too. Mass entrenchment. Um, experience scout platoons. Yeah, I'll probably go with that one. So we can go to where we want to now, which is great. Don't have to. Stage funded radio broadcasting. Military sending bonuses would be next as well. I just don't know if we could hold them off. Rockets to cryptology is done, which is nice. If you were just a solid front line here, could you actually help them out? I'll save just in case. Lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of guns. And military sending bonuses would be nice too. So if we went to war. Oh, they're war with the Desperados. How would that look like? Two beds are involved now. <clears throat> Could we hold out against them? Oh, good God, they got a lot of divisions here. Smoke grenades are nice. Still a little ahead of time there. I guarantee they're going to start attacking us somewhere. We're wrong before, but we'll see. That's a lot of divisions. Oh my god. Oh, they're not going to start moving. Maybe we'll start moving here to here. I just want to see defensively if we could hold them off, but they don't want to attack us. We do have air. We might have air superiority. You never know. It's because you have a lot of divisions. Doesn't mean they're any good. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, we're doing some damage to them. Very nice. I guess we'll make a little wedge. Go to Grand Berry. Not bad so far. Just gotta keep an eye on that manpower though. Good. Good job, guys. Could okay, you guys go here and go here? Do we have air superiority? We do. We're actually doing some damage too. I like it. Awesome. Help them from the other side too. As much as I love special forces, they're going to get the crap bean out of them. And would you look at that? Very nice.
Good. Oh, now they're definitely attacking us. Um, another area that would be good to attack is right here. Yeah, we gotta do like that, probably. Hey, even better special forces stuff, yes. Go straight through, go there, you might be able to circle division or two. Let's go. Song from the front, war sport or political power? Well, let's maximize that war sport, even though it doesn't really matter at this point. Good. Very nice. Because I only need a couple divisions over here. Uh, now we're going to really definitely start encircling them. They're still at 119 divisions max, maybe. They've lost 22,000? Holy cow. Yeah, AI is doing so great. Um, we might be able to go this way. Recon 4. Nice. Get more soft attack, hard attack initiative. Well, I love recon. Oh, yeah. God's kingdom on earth. Holy cow. The Mormon Alliance. Holy. They actually did it. They actually became Deseret. Dead Horde Apostles. That's disgusting. Look at that. Wow. Some of the guys are. Oh, they're just fighting each other now. And they're fighting the Legion. Where? Hello? Oh, they must be here. Still dead? Wow. Well, the Legion still exists, technically. Alright then. Good, come and attack and see what happens. Come on, get down there, man. Take one of you. Just hold him off for now. Good. Look at all those divisions being the Twisted Circle. Beautiful. Throwing everything they have at us. <clears throat> Pick up brown wood. Once you get them, they'll be starving for supplies in just a little bit. Oh, we got more than enough army XP now, huh? There you go. How dastardly. Look at all those divisions. They're trying to escape so they can do better, but... Oh well. So now they are 88 divisions, and they've lost 8.7. And we have done about half of the war score participation. Fantastic. Once we delete enough enemy divisions, then we'll do a generic attack.
good. A little bit ahead of time there. So we can wait perhaps on that one. Anything else we can do now? Nah, we're waiting anyways. Whatever. Screw it. Let's do it. Motorized sniper is nice. Ah, do it anyways. Who cares? Just don't let him leave. Even more divisions go bye bye. Yay! Hey! Welcome aboard! Alright, so we're gonna come from here now. Down to Fort Hood. Awesome, get a little more time to get more. Okay, that's my time. Have fun with it. It doesn't mean they're any good at it. Go ahead, Apple. Beautiful. Keep those guys there. Once we can probably screw it up some more. They still have a lot of divisions. They just have a ton of divisions. 61 left. That's not too bad. We probably actually should be able to beat them up this way. Two, three, four. It's awkward and weird, but we'll do it like this, I guess. Good job, guys. Uh, we gotta worry about this style here too. Special Force should be able to break over the river, but you never know. There you go. Good stuff. So now, last one I promise. <clears throat> These three. Well, let's look at these guys here. And we'll just have a, a generic attack. That'll be fine. Look at all that PP I've completely ignored. Stability, yes. Um, how many standard points are we getting? 30? That's not bad. And now we can also do this one too. Combine struts. K bind, something like that. You know what? There you go. At this point, just go ahead. And Max Planner's fine. Boom, boom. Just rip and tear. Good. You guys are coming over here. And you'll take out the two beds by yourselves. You'll be fine. So now we're 73%. We lost 300. We killed off 20,000. Oh no, we killed off 24,000? Something like that? 25,000. Beautiful. Oh, hello. Everyone's exploding over there. Very nice. Mm, okay. Looking pretty nice. I love it. I always do recon and stim packs more over uh, a lot of other things here. Out of anything else? Oh, Waco, it's not good. Oh, we're actually looking pretty good on everything. Any more air bases at all? I could put more stuff on. 
a missed opportunity. All right then. Ball of the Alex, Dex okay, Dexas is ours. Great. Awesome. Hey, looking pretty good. The Masters of Texas. With the fall of the Brotherhood, we can forge an empire. Hope Mom will be proud. We'll be known as the Texas Tyranny. Oh, we get free cores? We get more division recovery rate, war support, division attack, and infantry division attack, and breakthrough. Oh, that's fantastic. Republic of the Rio Grande has to die. Well, I guess they don't have to. But then again, we need Estados de Pecos. So I guess they do have to die. Uh, yeah, do that one anyway. Nuclear mastery. Sure. Uh, we could have gotten new research problem, but we're honestly okay, kind of okay with what we've got for now. Any more money? Army training. Very cool. Could use more scrap though. You're technically part of Texas. You are not. Get a Maz. Oh my God. We're so justifying, aren't we? For more political power. Yep. And it'll be removed in a few weeks. It's fine with us. Ooh. That sucks. No, it's good. Go with old world conscription. Hey, we found him. Um, Seen that one coming. We did. Hey, by the river shore, as a lone star that would win the civil wars and hand war band and go on to succeed from the former Texas tyranny. Look at that. Death or subjugation? That's cool. Are we missing anything here? We're looking pretty good. Playing Texas, perhaps? Do we have no ships? It's alright. You know what? Let's get Houston first. Well, actually, yeah, can we do that? Nice. That would be great. Are the Chichen Itza are up here? Wait, what? Uh, holy crap. Not ideal. Well, let's take out whatever parts of Texas that we can first. Still working on it. Manufacturers, I suppose. Why not? And able designer, heavy ships. And there we go. You know what? We might leave those guys last. Because that's a good little buffer to have between us and the Rio Grande. If we could focus the Rio Grande up here, for the most part, that we might actually be able to survive that way. Uh, Texan Economic Union? Oh, you're still alive? Yeah, not for long. Desperados, yeah, that took extra time. Alright. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 
And you definitely need some radar up there too. Oh, they're forcing the defense. No wonder it's taking so long. There you go. Well, there goes NCR. Yep. Sounds about right. And now we have a fleet. Fantastic. Are we going to use it very much? No. Nuclear mastery, if you want to do it without, please go ahead. Uh, my bad. Texas tyranny. Oh, we're going to increase the compliance point now. This also gives us a lot of time to build up our own forces, too, which is very nice. Tech Wizard, Fort Defender, Lucky, it's not bad. You can be a local leader. And a life leader. And mysterious. Ooh la la. Mysterioso. Nice. Because you can. Do you think? Machine guns. Heavy machine guns. Very nice. Mmm, drugs. Here's ours. How long will it take to out the desperados? That's not bad. 90 days is actually pretty good. Good. Houston's finally ours too. Isn't Dallas a trade note too? No. First people's junction is. Well, I have fun with it. Do the best I can. More planes here and there. That'll be good. Very nice. Beautiful. First desperados are next, just let time go on. Pick up parts of Louisiana and whatnot. Great cons, far sun, train, roads. We're still lacking a lot of scrap, huh? 41, wow. That is quite a bit. Am I gonna do anything about it? Not really. Hmm. Uh, Scavenger vehicle, sure. Anything else here? State funded radio broadcasting? Absolutely. Build a couple more labs, probably. Um, we're not going to increase the political power anymore. Oh, we can do improved country management, maybe. We got one, too. we got a little bit of time here. Uh -huh. That'll be nice. That'd be very nice. Oh, where are we at? Almost done with this too. Fantastic. Sure. How many more days do we have now? Good. Don't stop training for now. Because the glass is good. 
And the other of core creation cost is awesome. Should have realized this a while ago. Boom. Boom. I do want to get all these Yana first though. If if we can. 160 days. Wow. That's such a long time. Why is it so long? Go ahead. Uh, worst part's looking pretty good. Why'd you go back that way? Logistics. Oh. Very nice. Cool. Who needed scrap, right? Now we're not going to pause the game at all. Just let it run, 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 run. We should be fine. Uh, boom, bada, boom, bada. We should be okay. Quick housing. Fine, we get one scrap. From the shacks, of course. Boop, 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 boop. Very nice. Boop, boop. Boop. And we get one solid boop right there. Nice, we're done with that. Good stuff. Wires fine with us because we don't really care. Oh, they're gonna take out the Egyptian. It's oh, yeah. I'll leave the Austrian Republic alive for now because that's gonna be a gigantic group that we're going to take out later on. Um, so uh, humanity, to human supremacy. Yeah, we must become supreme. Uh, honestly, let's go ahead and do this one. Beep and fuck. Hell, they want to kill each other, that's fine with me. We need more manpower in the end, though. But of course, more stuff, too. Six control, nice. What's next? This one. Advanced smell tree. Painted rock. But you know what, painted rock? You can go kill yourself. I don't think they're 41. Uh, sure, I'll point out. There's a research slot. Hmm. I think we're okay on research slots. I'm going raid, of course, because why? Makes no sense to me, but whatever. They're getting raided? Okay, there you go. There you go. Keep pumping us up. Recording place yet? No, but some of these places have a lot, quite a decent amount of manpower as well. Uh, Houston. Organization would be nice. Boop, and bop. How much money do we get every quarter? 151, that's not much. That's better than what we used to get, but still. Not too much longer. Go on a power drive. So then we'll do that with we'll the patrolman, the bayou motors. The Rio Grande is going to be a giant problem for us. Uh, we'll have waterway here, one, two armies here, three ish. Ah, not too bad for us. A few more wars and we'll have them down. Let's destroy them, hopefully. They found nothing. Great. Good job, ding dongs. Yeah, just go to war. And 105 days, not bad. Oh. I assume we're only taking it with one division. That's probably not a good idea, but whatever. 
prospectors, sure, and military sending bonuses. Yes, please. Nice. Gator Mars. Thank you so much for playing. Your contribution to our survival will be noted. And now we're going to need a lot of radios. Oh, we have 5,000, 6,000. We don't maybe we only need 5, I don't know, let's see. Canneries, nice. Screen penalties, penalties, yeah. That stuff is all alright to do, we don't have to do it yet. But we can grab some of this, and that would be pretty nice. We also got the last lodge. Anything else? Yeah, I always like life here, just recovering faster is just super nice. Yeah, look at that man power. So I get just stacking up, storing up a lot of political power here. Get down here, get over here. Oh! Well then. Yeah, just real packed. So the real pack has now gone to war with the NCR. Oh, this is like a perfect time. So after after the patrolman, we gotta go to war with the real pack. How many days would it take for us to just farm them? Oh, 40? Oh, that's good. Because we're already on max conscription level, right? Yeah, unfortunately. Nice. They're actually doing relatively well, which is good for us. So I want to take at least all the parts of Texas that we want. Divisions, but luckily with the Texas Brotherhood, doesn't mean that they're very good. So here's what we gotta do. You will go there. There's only 16 of you, so you're gonna go here. 17 of you here. I'm gonna send you waterway here. And then you as soon as we can, we will go to war, because it looks like the NCR is actually doing all right. Oh god, how big is the New California Republic? 489 divisions, Jesus Christ. That's insane. It's California, what do you expect, but still. And they have a lot, don't get me wrong, but it's nowhere near as much. Just gotta wait a couple seconds. Profits from the drug trade, pass me a hat. Pass me a fat doobie. Anyways, uh, there you go. Since we're at peace, we should be able to raise compliance a little bit faster. Yes, please, yes, please. Go where you want, pretty much. We should be more than fine with all this stuff. Ooh. Oh, good. I would call them the free fighters too. That's good. I'm just not super worried about them. You know, at the very least, let's do these guys too. 
So they want to fight us, so pull divisions away from their border with NCR, which is a giant mistake. As long as we get all the Texas, that's all I care about. That's what I really want. Nice job, guys. Keep pushing. Yeah. What a loss is like. 9,000. 29. Wow. We've actually done more casualties than NCR has been to them. Nice. Conveyors, nice, good. Good, good, good. It's a lot of fun, the hand war band, once you uh, get to the first initial war. A lot of fun. Anti armor tactics, good. Very nice. And we're out of manpower, of course. I mean, we're fully out of manpower. We have nothing left to spare. Um, well, you know what? Let's do new citizen care package. As much as I want to do state funded radio programming, that's not as important as raising conscription level higher. So. There you go. Found a bit more manpower for now. Tiny bit. Very slight. God, this crap again. I hate this so much. Should be fine in the end, but as long as we don't get encircled. Oh god, we're gonna get encircled. Good, good. And just flood through here. Oh, the NCR has war goals on these guys too? What the heck? That means the NCR wants to come kill us too, probably eventually in the end. It's not ideal. We're getting close to Liber City. Liber or Lieber? Oh, hello. Do we get in circle here? God dang it, guys. Can we do better than this? Seriously. What's wrong with you? Oh, is this Lannis' Legion still or something? Oh, that's the NCRs. What, the Barnacles? Can you attack this way, maybe, please? Okay, as long as we get these divisions out of there, that's all I care about. The NCRs are not at that territory. By far and large. What are you doing up here? Come on, go all the way to Dog City. The reason why I put you all the way over there. Bro, come on. You know what? You can have it. I don't want to do that for now. We'll do them later. giant mess. This is where we're incurring probably a lot of our casualties. Uh, get some more airsport. No, oh, can't give them any more airsport on it. I do a few planes. That's good. How much more can they actually put up with? Good, Glory's gone. 
They still have 129 divisions. My god. Definitely can't hold there, but we gotta have people like keep going south. But they'll link up actually eventually, which is pretty good. Human superiority tech. Uh, recon. Stronger division defense attack and speed. Oh, yeah. You guys are gonna get encircled again. How stupid are you? Why is the NCR like stalling out? Because they definitely are. So, honestly, I think I'll finish this part up off screen and then, uh, yeah. We'll have one more episode because we gotta take our territory back here, take out the Lost Lodge, Austin Republic, and the Bayou Motors. So, I didn't plan on this, but one more episode. If you enjoyed the video though, please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow so we'll finish up the campaign playing as the Texas Tyranny. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.